Tyreek rolled his tongue across his teeth. He checked the time on his Rolex again, before shaking his head. All evening, he hadn't wanted to pull out his phone, fearful he'd see a text from Janae that said she wouldn't be able to make it to dinner. Like always, Janae had never been a consistent lover since they met months ago through his brother Khalil and Honey. In the beginning, Janae, being an on-call nurse, was admirable. Tyreek loved the chase and proving himself valuable of what little free time she had. The more he got to know Janae, the more he realized she wasn't so hard to catch because of her devotion. She was hard to catch because she didn't want to be caught. When he couldn't take it anymore, Tyreek pulled his phone out of his pocket. Sure enough, he had a missed call and text notification from Janae. Nurse Feelgood I'm so sorry, love. I got called in. Let me know when I can make it up to you. Shoving his phone back into his pocket, Tyreek gave the waitress that was hovering over the table his attention. She'd been coming back every few minutes for the past hour, each time looking sadder and sadder. Are you ready to order, sir? Tyreek's eyes shifted to the woman pulling the empty chair back that was across from him. He is, she said, sitting down. Admittedly, she was beautiful. Tyreek had noticed her at the bar when he first arrived. But he wouldn't do more than let his eyes linger. His mother raised him and Khalil to be gentlemen, and she was an advocate for women. He'd never cheated a day in his life, and he didn't plan on starting now. Tyreek hadn't bothered to look over the steakhouse menu, partly because he was sure he'd just leave the waitress a $100 tip and leave. Now that he had a dinner companion, he didn't mind staying. Let me get whatever cocktail you have with whiskey and ginger beer, Tariq said, eyeing the woman's face intently. And you can put her bar tab on my ticket as well. Yes, sir, the waitress agreed before walking away.